Wait, hold on. We don't have you yet. Oh, we'll just catch another one. It's all good. There we go. You caught another Nidoran. So apparently you get bonuses too if you catch like a shit ton of the same Pokemon also. Dude, you're the one we're after. Excellent! I was slightly tempted just for a little Pokeball controller just cause you get Mew in it. I'm like, eh, I don't know man, it's $50. Hey, everyone. Oh, shit, almost everybody leveled up that time. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, big guy. Let's get rid of Growl. I never use that, anyways. Ta da! Pikachu forgot Growl or Double Kick. Alright. Yes, we get it. Everybody leveled up. Very cool. Thanks. Poison type. Alright, anyways, let me check. Did you oh, sorry, so you're the brave one. I wanna get oops wrong. I wanna go ahead and switch out that other Pidgey just so I don't get confused and I grab the wrong one. Or keep the wrong one in the party, so. Let's go ahead, since we got multiple of you, and we go ahead and add the party. And switch you out with him. There we go. Let's continue on our way. Hey! Oh, hey, Prof Toast! Hoping to make the Pokemon League someday, too? Well, there we can battle the strongest of all Pokemon trainers and the ones they call the Elite Four. I was hoping maybe I could get a glimpse out of it, but the guard at the gate wouldn't let me in. I'll pass without badges from all the Pokemon gems. Guess I'll have to get there along the way by battling and getting strong. So, Proptos, I guess that means it's on then. Oh, okay, I guess we're battling again, whatever. Take that, look at that, I got a Pidgey now. What's up? Alright, Pikachu, you know, you know the drill. Thundershock just in the death. Fuck, that was a one hit. Alright. Won't bite, Pidgey. Ah, I don't know. I feel like keep battling with this guy. Pui! Good level 7, huh? Try a double kick. Sorry, Sam. Kind of kicked your ass again. So, uh, yeah. All right. All right. We know everybody leveled up again. Huh? Seriously? That's right. You give me that hundred forty Poke dollars. Hmm, maybe battling like this is just helping you get stronger, huh, Prof Toes? <laughs> See, look at he's too nice. He's like, oh, well, well, that works too, I guess, yeah. At least one of us will make it. Yeah. Alright, anyways, any more Pokemans for us to grab? There's another end. That would just be the entrance. There's a Pokeball right there, so let's go ahead and catch this guy. Get some extra HP, or XP. Oh, you bitch. Come on. Oh, come on, man. You're getting the ball. There we go. I'm 
right, you caught a Nidoran. Okay, I'm gonna Alright, now let's go ahead and get our extra item down here. Hey, yeah, sweet, got five more Pokeballs. Let's go ahead and explore a little bit of the town and see what we can find. I believe no, I don't think we have the first gym whatsoever here. That should be the next town afterwards. There's a Poke School, a bunch of useless bullshit. I can't learn the crap in there. Nah. Look at me, I'm a ten-year-old and I know everything. And travel the world. No parental super guidance ever. Wow, your Pokemon is riding on you. On you. That's super cute. I think my Pokemon would be a bit too heavy. That's why I had to walk with me instead. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot. I can do that now, can I? That's fine. They just automatically put it there. There you go. Look at that. Let's see. Who do I want to walk with me? I will do... Need a rain. That's actually more funny when you have freaking um, something like Onyx go after you because that thing's freaking huge and pretty much you're just riding on top of them. Oh wait, hold on, I forgot. It's always closed, the gym leader's never here. Oh yeah, yeah, so I forgot the first town, gym leader's not there, I think that'll probably be like the last one you fight. But yeah, one thing I do like is uh, they actually kept the sizes accurate, like when Charmander evolves into Charmeleon uh, pretty much it actually looks like, oh shit, he actually did grow up quite a decent little chunk. And he's actually like half the size, I'm like, oh god, when he gets the Charizard he's gonna be freaking huge. Oh, give me a break, Weedle, come on. There we go. All right, you got a Weedle. Hey, you grew to level eight. All right, now we gotta go ahead. I think Viridian Forest is the next area we're gonna be heading into. Hey girl, what's up? Your Pokemon uses a move at the same time as itself. The move's more powerful and it'll get a boost. I like how he looks looking to this doorway that's just like straight up like, yep, that's a straight forest right there. Alright, let's go ahead. We got the classic bug trainers. I'm here with some friends to catch some bug type Pokemon. My pals and I are itching to get in some weird Pokemon battles. So I guess that means I should uh, watch out for you guys. You guys are rooting too and dangerous. Yes, I know. I know. Give you some, give you some berries. Like, give me a break. It's level three, okay? Nice. Right, you got a Caterpie. All right, let's see here. There you go. Yep. Do you? <laughs> hey, do you have a big Pikachu? Oh, I got a big something. Oh yeah. This is like really random as shit, so it's like, I see him walking by, as like, first thing, he's like, hey, mister, do you have a big Pikachu? Ugh. I'm so bad at that, man. I like how you literally just freaking chuck Pikachu in the battle, like, oh yeah, get him, Pikachu. Kick his ass. 
And one shot. That's one thing I did notice in this game, it is pretty easy catching those Pokemon just to level up like crazy, especially with your whole team, so kind of early on you get pretty decently high level. Hey look, a Metapod. I'm gonna just add that to my party for later on. Yep. Yeah. How about that work of a Metapod traveling around with you? I kind of want to see that now. Oh shit, this one's actually not letting me catch her right away. Alright, fine, we'll actually use a berry for once. What the hell? Ah, this metapod is actually being difficult. This is crazy, man. They're just like, not letting me capture them right away, and I'm like... Oh, really? I have to see if they actually just run away if you try to capture them too many times. Alright, let's try another berry. Oh, this one seems really reluctant to be captured. Wait, really now? Huh. Even on my other profile where I'm actually, you know, further ahead, I've not had this much issue catching a Pokemon yet. There we go. Holy crap. You do not want to be cut at all. Alright, so... a decent size. I just want to see what it looks like when you freaking have one of these guys traveling with you. So let's go ahead, check out... So curious, so let's see. We got a lonely nature. Where's the sounds? Hmm. I'll go ahead and add it to the party for now. Let's see, let's switch out this one. Now I just want to see because how the heck would he I'm kinda of curious how he would actually follow you, but Okay, yeah, apparently he just freaking scoots along he's like, Alright, I'm coming along with you. Oh, we have a lot of Caterpies around here. I guess for all those freaking bug catcher guys and stuff and everybody, Oh boy, we can catch so many bug Pokemon. I don't know why they're actually being harder to kill. Okay. I didn't even know I threw that one. Let's get out of here. Wait, hold on. We got a Pokeball. Hey, I got five more Pokeballs instead of this, inside of this one Pokeball. That's crazy. Alright, let's go ahead and battle this guy. Oh, you have a party Pokemon? Let's get a better look at it then, huh? You're challenged by Thrill Catcher Brian. Here he comes, this totally badass leader. We'll see how tough it is. Take this! Yeah, not very tough. Oh, before I knew it, I already lost. Another Metapod. Let's see if we got this guy. Hopefully he's not a much of a pain to freaking catch, but we're gonna let's go ahead and use a berry. 
Just to be on the safe side. Here you go, buddy. First try. Alright, Metapod leveled up. Alright, now let's go ahead and see. Hey, it's Kakuna, dang it. I know we need to go further, but there's so many Pokemons I don't have. Alright, let's go ahead, check out our Metapod we just got. He's a docile, I don't know exactly which ones. Did they just like get a print out of it so I can like kinda double check like alright that one's good. We actually do need a Kakuna, so. Or yeah, it'd be cool if you could just take all all your Pokemon out of the Pokeballs and just have like this herd of Pokemon following you around everywhere. You're like, so if you could please just put your Pokemon back in the balls, like no, they like to be free. The free range Pokemon, okay? You can't contain them. Sometimes you can actually pretty much overthrow it at random times too. Alright, I got another Kakuna. Yes! Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, fine, we'll catch an otter to squirt. God, I catch so many of you guys. Another one, guys. Wow, that is uh, pretty fucking cool. All right, now let's continue. Here's an oddish. Hey, look at that! All right, we got some mushrooms, boys. Let me get crazy. There are so many Pokemon everywhere. Hey, look, what we got here? Okay, so that's where we started. Uh oh. Uh oh. Watch out. Hey, you have Pokemon, right? Come on, let's battle them. Man, that's supposed to be crazy, just trying to, like, alright, I'm just trying to walk through this forest. I'm just trying to get to the next town, okay? Having half of these little freaking five year olds are like, come on! Come battle my Caterpie! My level three Caterpie, I just, just barely got right now. Come on, I can easily take you on. Hey, yes, she has a level three Caterpie, too. Sorry. Sorry, kid. Beatbucketcher? No! Caterpie can't hack him! I'm like, yeah, dude, it's level 3. What the heck? Jeez, man, trying your shit. I just realized we have not saved once in yet. So, I'll go ahead and put a little save here real quick. Alright. What do we got? Three raspberries. Hey kid, I was throwing Pokeballs to catch Pokemon and I ran out of them. That's why you can never have too many. Yeah, you know, back in the day you could carry like 10 and be pretty solid, but now you gotta catch anything that moves.
Hey girl, how you doing? What's up? Hey, do you know Bulbasaur appears in this forest? Well, ma'am, I can go ahead and guarantee you that no, no they do not. You have plenty of Pikachus though. Four. Hey, damn, I'm gonna get that guess in these levels right now. Could you please listen to what I have to say, please? And like, lady, you walk up to me and try the battle, okay? And you try to act like I'm not listening to you. Oh my god. Hey, you. Hey, yo, you can't punk out on the battle if you're a real Pokemon. Oh my god, what are you gonna do? Bust out another level freaking three Caterpie? You only have like one Pokemon. I oh, know, you got a Kakuna. Alright, let's go ahead. Got a pushover, I swear. Alright, she's so getting the regular one. Uh, fire type, we'll have a Charmander on here. Oh god, it's like forces on fire. Like, are you all kidding me? Uh, I've got no other Pokemon to battle with. Well, yeah. What the hell, dude? But anyways. Hey, Bulbasaur, holy shit. Oh, well, never mind. I was completely wrong. This is actually the first time I didn't have uh, beforehand. I never actually encountered a Bulbasaur in the wild before. I'm like, huh, I did not know Bulbasaur could actually appear in here. Well, okay, that is actually a big surprise to me. This is a decent nature, and guess what? I'm gonna have my grass type way early on. She go back, I guess you just go ahead and run back and tell her, like, hey, yeah, by the way, there are actually Bulbasaurs over here. I was wrong, sorry about that. What do you got for a nature? That's so weird because last time when I played with some other save file and stuff, I did not see bubble swords whatsoever. I saw a bunch of Pikachus, that's about it though. Alright, what do we got for a summer here? Got a docile. What's up all these docile ones? I'm actually gonna straight up look it up real quick and everything just because I'm actually curious. Alright, hold on, hold on. Let's see what we got here. See, so our docile is pretty much... Huh? You know, I guess I guess we can deal with that. Because docile pretty much... It doesn't really have any ups or downs across the board. It's kind of just neutral. So I was like, alright, that's... I can, I can deal with neutral. Uh, let's see. We're keeping Pidgey on our team. Let's go ahead and get rid of... Metapod. I guess we can evolve him later if we really want to. Alright, that looks good. That is so weird. I was not expecting to find Bulbasaurs in this forest. Yeah, that was a complete shock. Oh great, what are we running to now? Pidgey? Yep. Yeah, of course, the frickin' Pidgey here! Get up to get in the Pokeball! I'm gonna trade you for a sack of candy and you're gonna like it. Oh, right, everybody level. Of course, I don't know. Depending on... Well, we'll have to see what we get, because I know later on we do actually get a... Bulbasaur from another lady and stuff, but that one's actually close to level 15, so pretty much just evolves right off the bat, but Uh, hold on. Who's learning double kick? I did not even see Oh, you're learning double kick, so I guess we'll go ahead and get rid of Growl I guess I'll have to see exactly where you get the bubble circus. If I'm gonna get it like a level 15 right off the bat. And who knows, maybe it's a better nature? I don't know. 
Because normally I would just sit there and like restart the game to just get whatever nature I needed, but fortunately I'm not going to be doing that during a playthrough, so we're going to have to kind of not be as picky. up here already? Yeah, I think so. Alright. Did I have any Pokemon follow me? Alright, hold on. Uh, Bulbasaur. You can follow me around. Why not? You want to know the trick to throwing a Pokeball well? Ah, uh, yeah, you see, you get your Joy-Con, and you go like that. Or if it's over to the side, you go like that. And then, and then you're pretty much good. Ah, uh, Pikachu, kick its ass. You know, you know the drill. You thundershock that bird, and tonight we're gonna have a good dinner. Cool guys. Yeah, depending well depending on how we play through this and shit, we might actually be able to get bubble sore level 15 before we know it. Alright, let's go ahead, keep going. Keep going up there. Oh, okay, never mind. I was gonna say around here I think this is where all the other Pikachu start showing up. Huge. I think the ones that will wear, they have the yeah. So for whatever one, these are like the freaking extra large cocoons. I don't know why they come in like these gigantic ass sizes. Actually, no. I want to see how bigger if it actually looks bigger with me freaking taking it around. Hold on. Let's go ahead. Okay, so that was way over through here. <laughs> There we go. Alright, you got yourself a little cocoon right there. Alright, oh, you got your mirror. The leader seems fucking huge. Alright, so, so out of curiosity, I just want to see see if this actually does look that freaking big in your party. Let's go ahead. Add the party. We're going to switch you out with a Rattata. And go into our party. Take you out of the Pokeball. Ah, it's about average size. So I guess that part doesn't make it a big difference on what it looks like outside of the Pokeball, but as for when they evolve, they actually do look, you know, pretty accurate to what their size should be, so it's pretty cool. Alright, one more trainer, come on. Hey, wait up, what's the hurry? Why the rush? I don't know, man, I've just been trying to get through this forest and I have every fucking five-year-old trying to... and lady trying to, what is it, what is it, challenge me to a Pokemon battle. Frank, get out of here. Go ahead, bring your little freaking Metapod. All knows how to do his hard end. He's gonna thunder shock you once and you're dead. Alright, here we go. Here we go, folks. Oh, wow. Yo, figure, he didn't beat me with a Metapod. That's crazy, kid. How did that happen? I give. You're good at this. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? I'll take the compliment. Why not? Okay, now we're finally in the next town. Hey, mister. I heard CP, the hub, or higher the combat power is. You don't say. Oh, 
Alright, here we go. Let's hope we run into each other. You know the person Pokemon Gym up this way, right, Proptos? You can battle against Gym Leader there, he's seriously strong. If you want to get stronger, you're definitely going to have to take him on. Okay. Ah, jeez, Pikachu, you're really good for this battle, aren't you? You ready for... Uh, whatever he's saying, blah. Okay, I oh, might want to cheer you guys on, so take these. Oh, God. So friendly. How is this a rival? Uh. It's too nice. Uh. Okay. Any freaking ways, let's go ahead. Let's just jump right on into it. Where's it? Where's this gym? Oh shit, it's a Butterfree. Alright, all right, here we go. I'm actually liking this one too, because you actually legitimately have people sitting there watching the battles. Oh yeah, you're here to ch challenge the gym, aren't you? I'm not a trainer, but I can tell you if you're worthy of challenge gym leader. Now let's get started. I like how they go like, well, we only allow type matchups, so we're gonna have to make sure you have uh, some form of Pokemon that's, you know, weak against Brock, so yeah. Yeah, it's a good thing Ash didn't have to go through these requirements or else they'd be looking at him going like, Seriously? Pikachu? Yeah, okay, get out of here, kid. This is Peter City Gym. Trainers here are a bit different from the ones you face so far. Okay, we'll see about them later. You did my deal, dude. Pikachu, you think you got this? Let's try a double kick. Oh, okay. That actually does a pretty decent amount of damage against Geodude, surprisingly. Okay, give us one little more kick. Yeah. All right. I haven't even brought out my type of energy yet. Quite different challenge from the others I've faced. Oh. Alright, next. Stop right there, kid. You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. I don't know about that, man. Let's see if you're any more of a challenge. Let's see how much energy I did. Alright. Why not? Oh shit. Are you sure I'm 10,000 light years from beating Brock? Because I just kind of kicked her ass with one move, so... I don't know, man. It's a measure of distance. Oh. Alright, Brock. You're gonna be more of a challenge, right? So you're here. I'm Rock, the Peter City Gym Leader. You can just uh you can just see by looking at my Pokemon how rock hard my willpower is at least. My Pokemon are all as rock uh, are all hard as rock and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all rock types. If you couldn't tell. So be it. Wakanda forever. One Prof Toast. Wakanda. Wakanda forever. You will see the true power. Alright, let's see what you got. Oh, level 11. Alright, you're actually equal level to me. What a twist! Oh, look at that. This might actually be a slightly challenging battle. Or maybe not, I don't know, we'll see. 
the original Game Boy version, this is actually way more of a pain in the ass just because you usually only have to level your Pokemon up pretty well to be able to beat them. Let's see here. Yeah, Pikachu leveled up. What's my double team? Yeah, I'm good. Let's see what we do against Onyx. Now let's see who do we got here. We got level 7, 10. Yeah, let's try Oddish. Come on, Oddish. You, you think you got this, Oddish? Can you take down the full Onyx? I think our little plan here can do it. Let's do it. Come on. Ouch. And fucking one shot it, Jesus. Man, they weren't kidding when they were talking about this type of advantages, were they? Oh, it's like rock throw. Me and like absorb! Oh look, they won! Oh boy. I just think what would have happened if I just used the Otter right off the bat. I would just level one shot at both your Pokemon. If he wants to a quick attack, sure, why not? What do you got? What do you got? Just really get rid of sand attack. Alright, just everybody's leveling up. Seems I underestimated you. That's a lot of money, Brock. Thanks. As proof of your victory here, take the league badge, a boulder badge. Yeah, high five, Pikachu. The well, the Pokemon at the level 20 from other trainers will listen to you. Without question. Oh wait, take this with you too. They got a Wonder Trade in here. That'd be cool if they had a Wonder Trade. Use a Team Techno Machine. You can teach your Pokemon to move with it, and they can use it as many times as you want. See, back in my day, we had to calculate which teams we wanted to use. We don't just all use them all really nearly like. I bet you Sans is gonna be out here going, like, Holy shit! Oh, the, oh no, it's green. Don't tell me you've gotta be Prof Toast. I am, that's amazing. Ha, I knew it. I'm always right. See, that's the kind of dickish uh, freaking rival I want. Oh, it was blue. Green's a girl, yeah, okay. Never mind, I messed up. Ah, blue. I heard from Gramps that you two new kids set off on Pow Town and become trainers. Oh, uh, it? Just like I did once. So I came to check you out. I was thinking I might give you some advice on how to be the gym leader on an expert trainer like me, but it looks like I showed up too late, huh? Seems like you're not too shabby yourself, so I guess you've earned the reward, newbie. Oh, sweet, great balls. It would be even better for catching Pokemon than playing old Pokeballs. And hey, for that thing you've got there, the Pokedex, right? So Grimms finally went and made one. He used to make me just scribble on a map and pencil about what I encounter in Pokemon. You better do a good job of helping him out. He may be Professor Oak to you. I'm sure he is an old coot, but he's still my Gramps. Smell you later, newbie. Yow. All right, at least one of them's a dick. Okay, now I know that we got the Pokemon Museum. I don't know where on earth the freaking. I'm trying to think of where exactly. What... Oh no, wait, we still got a bit of a ways before we run into the person who actually gives you Bulbasaur. So let's go ahead. Head on over to the Pokemon Center since I don't think we've actually been in one. Oh no, we did go in one earlier. There's Joy. You don't have your Pokemon PC anymore. You just carry all of them with you. I think you're waiting. Your Pokemon should be all better now.
All right then, folks. I do believe this is where we're going to be leaving off. I do hope you guys enjoyed. We will definitely be continuing this journey since it's been a while since I've actually done, you know, Pokemon on this channel. But, yeah, so if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that post notification bell. And if you did like this video and you're already subscribed, be sure to hit that like button because it definitely helps out a lot. And as always, I thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys later.